we're getting a lot of uh, a lot of practice at it. <laughs> There's so many penalties over the last uh, bunch of games that, uh, again, as I said last night after the game, we have to clean this up. You, know, you get into a five on threes, uh, three games in a row now. It's it's very hard. <clears throat> but saying that, it's it's where you have to dig in and you have to get the job done. You know, your your goaltending has to be good. And and two back, I thought in the in the second period there on those penalty kills, uh, man, he was really good. He made some very big stops, not to take anything away from the guys that were on the ice in front of him, but uh, he's your last line and, and he had to make some big stops there, so very good. I counted something like nine saves. You don't didn't by chance get a count off the video, did you? No, I haven't looked at anything, no. Uh, Seemed as much to know maybe during the intermission. They, they're, you know, they're a good team. they got a good power play. They're back end. They're, they're one blue line guys. They're second leading scorer on the team. And, you know, he's got a shot mentality. They just funnel pucks to the net. So, um, you know, they're going to put shots up. But the goalie was good. He was better here tonight. Um, overall, you know, in a first start, First AHL start and first start, I believe, since like October something, and in at any level, and you might have seen some cobwebs, but it uh, didn't look like that tonight. No, it didn't look like it. No, for sure. You, you, you know, you, you don't know. We don't see, or you don't see, all the things that that he does. Uh, uh, you know, outside of playing the game, he he really is dedicated to keeping himself as in as ready as possible without playing games. He gets out early on the ice. He does all his fundamentals. He's very hard working off the ice. So uh, I'm real happy for him. You know, he's uh, he's earned that right to play here tonight, and he's uh, he earned the right to, for the win. It was a it was a heck of a good uh, first win for him. Um, can we talk a little bit about the injuries lately? They're kind of adding up and kind of affecting the blue line. There, are you seeing that affect the game at all? Three breakaways in the first period. You know, that's as a defenseman, your job is to keep plays in front of you, and we got couple of young guys there going the wrong way at the at the wrong time and I, thanks Bruce good to see you uh, going the wrong way at the at the wrong time you know so that's experience that's making a decision that we have to get better at um, and when you have roster moves like that I mean you're forced to like LaMarche and all those call-ups um, is that affect the chemistry at all yeah, it does. You know, you're taking some pretty good players out of the lineup in uh, in Bruno Gervais and you know Conan's out um, that has an effect on your team. Colinetti, you know, injured last night. So you got a guy, a, a couple of guys who have been together for a couple of years. So the chemistry does get changed. But you got to give Lamarche and you got to give uh, Matt a lot of credit for coming in. You know, he drives six hours today to get here just before game time and steps in and plays and plays plays pretty well. You know, so it's uh, uh, you know. The, Smart guys, guys with good hockey sense, can make adjustments to new situations like that. And I thought he was uh, very good in his minutes. In a case like that, where you have, you know, Lamarche has only been here two days, um, Mike coming in just, you know, today. Is there? Did you consider splitting up uh, Lordson and Alt to then have somebody a little more experienced in each pair? Uh, no, uh, no, I didn't do that. I, I just wanted to. Uh, it was more important to have four guys and play more minutes. And you know, try to place Lamarche and Matt in, in situations where I felt comfortable, and I think that's what ended up happening. Um, you know, we've said it before: special teams wins games. You know, we've talked about the PK, and on the other side, three first time you guys have scored three power play goals. How you know, just kind of of a lift, I guess, is it to see that on both sides? <clears throat> yeah, it's, that's part of the game that obviously has been. No, not as good as what we want it to be all year long. And, you know, we're, we're watching and working at it, watching a lot of video. There's, there's games that I think we do a very good job on the power play and we don't score. The, the, the mindset of what we did here tonight has to stay. That's getting pucks to the net, net presence. You get traffic in front of goaltenders. Wrist shots like the one with Flanagan will find its way into the net sometimes. And, and get pucks down into that blue paint area and, and compete hard, you're going to get more goals. So... Uh, we're just going to have to reinforce what happened here tonight.